Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome back to another announcement sort of video. Um, this one is to bring awareness to Lithio League. So, uh, way, if you've been around me long enough, you know what Lithio League is. It's a gym league, plain and simple, uh, run by Terrolution23, uh, Brownie Boy TV, and Green Scrafty. Those are the three admins. Um, you know them from the LBA, which I've been in, um, you know, uh, Terrolution from the PDL, he's the co-admin with me, um, and I'm just basically saying we are open for challengers, I am actually one of the e elite four of that, which I believe we're called Knights this season, um, we're doing a very interesting kind of take, uh, so I'm going to be going over the rules for you guys, just so you guys have an, a clear understanding, challenge it it's fun all of the leaders are really good battlers um so it's challenging it's going to be challenging but people always enjoy it and i definitely think you guys will um it's also a mixture between singles and doubles battle i myself are du and doubles i think there's about four doubles gym leaders and two doubles elite four either way it's really cool it's a lot of fun so the rules uh no legendary uber pokemon allowed uh the reason we ban or they ban legendaries is because you know we, instead of being you know just like a regular gym lead league where you challenge and gym leaders and stuff there's usually stories um so the story for this is you know um the league is a bunch of people who worship i believe arceus um so because we worship arceus we can't use legendaries ourselves which is so annoying because i want to use Cresselia. but hey i love the lore um and then why did that pop up i was reading something damn it computer um so this season giratina took over so you guys have to go defeat them defeat us to defeat Giratina. I think that's what it is. I forget exactly, and I don't know where to find it, but you guys can ask them. Um, so, that's no legendaries and no ubers, obviously. Um, there are the clauses that are in effect. Species clause, which means you cannot have two Rotoms. You cannot have two Shuckles. You cannot have two of one Pokemon, and forms do count as one Pokemon, for the most part. Um, duplicate items, you can't have two Lumberries, you can't have two Leftovers. Um, sleep Claws, pretty standard, you can't have more than two Pokemon sleeping unless they went for rest themselves. Uh, evasion Claws, no evasion moves. Oh, hit, one hit KO Claws, um, and Endless Battle Claws. Um, and most of these you can find rules on Smoga. Excuse me. And there's a better description than my half-assed expl explanation. Um, no smoke on illegal moves, that's allowed. So swag play is not allowed. Swagger and foul play. Uh, again, you have to look up smoke on to know exactly what those are. Uh, you have to cl collect eight of the nine. So there are nine gym leaders and four elite four plus a champion. Um, so it, it's... um. You need to collect eight of the nine in order to be able to proceed to the Elite Four, also known as the Nobleman this season. Um, you have to save your battle code and submit it to the Lithio Region Twitter, which will be linked in the description below, and you can find all these rules as well on the Twitter page, uh, so be sure to check that out, and that's how you will sign up, so sign up through via that. Um, if you lose three times to the Knights, which are the Gym Leaders, or three times to one noble, you are disqualified. So basically what that means is um, you get three chances to beat each gym leader or noble or knights. All right. Knights. All right. You get three chances to beat them. If you lose all three chances, you cannot challenge that gym leader again. Um... But, obviously, you know, you have 8 out of 9, so missing one isn't that huge of a deal. However, if you lose another 3 times to another singular gym leader, you will be dropped from the league. Um, it's just our way of making it more challenging. Uh, so it's like 3 per, you know. Um, and then the same thing for the Elite Four. However, since there's less Elite Four, you know, four and they're called Noblemen, remember that, um, if you lose three times to a single nobleman, you are kicked out. Um, no hard feelings. <laughs> I know that, that there's no hard feelings on their end. Um, so the gym leader, aka night battles, will be lasting for two weeks. So whenever that starts, I don't know if there's an exact date yet, but you'll have the full span of two weeks to battle all the leaders, collect the orbs, and get to the Elite Four. And then the nobleman, aka the Elite Four, will last one and a half weeks. 
Um, so yeah, be sure to stay tuned for that. And the champion battle will happen as soon as you win all four of the elites. Um, Alright, so if more than two trainers make it past the champion, a mini tournament will happen. It'll be singles, 6v6, and single elimination. Um, so you better edge out the competition. No, um, it'll be fun. It's a lot of fun. Um, there are prizes for winning. Winner of the final tournament will receive any of the six Ors IV bred Pokemon of their choosing. Um, a trophy, an Arceus trophy, which I think is digital, but it's still cool as hell. Um, and the title of champ. Hey, that's pretty sweet. Uh, second place will get a three IV bred Pokemon from Oris. Um, and if no one beats the champion, they'll retain their title. So beat the champion, guys. Let's go. Um, so uh, I'm just I'm going through their Twitter, just going through everything to s make sure that I know. Um, so I'm just gonna go through their example meaning for the disqualification rules. So if you lose three times to the Swamp Knight because they're based on habitats, you are not disqualified yet. But you can't challenge that knight anymore. If you then lose three times to any other knight, I think singularly. So like if you challenge the Jungle Knight, I think there's a Jungle Knight, um, and you lose three times to the Jungle Knight after losing three times to the Swamp Knight you're disqualified. But if you lose two times to the Jungle Knight and one time to the Desert Knight, you're still good. You're still good. Um, but you can always lose two... Oh, yeah. But you can always lose two times and move to another Knight to avoid disqualification. Recall, there are only nine possible Knights this season. So, if you miss one of the Knights and you lose three times, you have to battle all the other Knights in order to pass. So just something to stay aware, stay aware of. For the Elite Four, same rules apply as last season. Lose three times to a single Elite Four, and you will be disqualified. So that, my friends, is the the rules, the season. I fully expect to see you guys there. I'm expecting to have some fun. Um, I'll go over the list of gym leaders. We've got the Vault. Um, I don't know if we exactly put out what habitats are. But um, habitats are what the gym leaders are using for this season. It's something uh, a little different. It's kind of like a gimmick sort of thing. Um, it's definitely something interesting, and I think I will be using a gimmick team. I'll be using my habitat team that I, I tried out with, because uh, I tried out for both Gym Leader and Elite Four. Um, I'll use my habitat team to give you guys a good idea of what that is. Um, but we've got a volcano, cave, desert, fields, water's edge... Urban, mountain, forest, and ocean. Ocean is actually double, so remember that uh, we get a lot of complaints even though we spell it out that it's doubles. Um, that it's doubles. So just just note that there are doubles battles mixed in between these singles battles. Um, they're all listed on the, on the Twitter, so if you just go to the Twitter, there's just a picture that says Lithio Season 6, and it lists all the leaders. Um, anything ma marked with an asterisk means it's a double battle. All right, and then the Elite Four, also known as the Nobleman. That's myself. I'm a Trick Room. I think you guys could have seen that coming. Um, Green Scrafty is Sand. Uh, Mr. Murkrow is Trapping, and uh, that's pretty interesting. Uh, it's been done before, and it's been done very well before, so it's very interesting. I think it was him. It might not have been him. I don't remember exactly who did it. It was a couple of seasons ago. Um, and then Sandshrew Bogut is Rain, and he's also doing doubles. So... I highly urge you guys to go check these out. I'm going to be doing these videos more often for things that I think you guys should go check out and things that you guys should go do. Um, just promotion, man. Just promotion. So I hope to see you guys there. I hope to see you guys at the Elite Four, and um, I appreciate it if you sign up. Everything will be down in the link to, in the description below. So peace.